Hello everyone. I am Sujata Sarvase from Madhyamika Shiksha. I am Mahatma Chudra Phule Junior College Rajpuri. Today we will discuss third chapter Ionic Equilibria. Next discuss let's start atom ionization of water. Atom ionization of water. Then the start. Pure water is very small extent and the ionization equilibrium of water represented as in this reaction water liquid plus water two moles of water first is and second is base reversible reaction H3O plus NPS plus OH minus NPS in this reaction equilibrium this reaction is equilibrium first is conjugated acid second is conjugated base conjugated acid base pair and form the conjugated acid base form next equilibrium constant k k means equilibrium constant k for the ionization of water is given by ionization of water is given by k is equal to always product upon reactant product upon reactant k is equilibrium constant is equal to concentration of h3o plus concentration of h3o plus into concentration oh minus ion upon h2 h2 two times means square h2 liquid square equation number 1 or k into a dash crossing product crossing product k into h2 square is equal to h3o plus concentration oh minus ion equation number 2 next a majority of water molecules are undissociated majority of water molecules in are undissociated next concentration of water can be treated as constant this molecules water is undissociated then can be constant then constant h2 square is equal to k dash h2 is equal to k dash substituting this equation to we get equation number 2 k into h2 square is equal to concentration h3o plus oh minus n equation number 2 this will be to the equation 2 k into k dash h2 square is equal to k dash k into k dash is equal to h3o plus concentration into concentration oh minus n equation number 3 where kw is equal to k into k dash where k into k dash is equal to kw kw means ionic product of water kw means ionic product of water next in pure water h3o plus ion always equal to concentration oh minus what is mean by ionic product of water ionic product means concentration of hydrogen ion and always equal to hydro oxy ions is called as ionic product of water next thus at 298 kelvin or 25 degree celsius this is the k k means temperature si need and Degree Celsius temperature rate of CGS system. Thus, at 298 Kelvin or 25 degree Celsius, this concentration is found to be 1.0 into 10 to minus 7 mole per liter. This unit is very very important of the concentration always equal to ions. 1.0 into 10 to minus 7 mole per liter. K W is equal to. There are two ions. First is H concentration H3O plus ion into 
concentration OH minus KW means ionic product of water. Next one always point two means one point zero into ten raised to minus seven into one point zero into ten raised to minus ten is equal to one point zero into seven plus seven for ten ten raised to minus fourteen in equation four in equation four this is the ionic product of water is equal to one point zero into ten raised to minus four fourteen equation four very very important KW is ionic product of water next what is will be pH scale next concept discuss with pH scale P means protons protons means Japanese word or P means power H means hydrogen hydrogen ions or hydrogen atom this concept uh, consider science name solvent sign in 1999 mathematical expression of the ph scale it is defined by as ph s negative logarithm base 10 concentration of hydrogen ion is called as ph it is denoted by pH is equal to minus log 10 concentration of H plus N E is called as pH scale. Similarly, pOH. pOH means OH minus ion. Solution. Definition of pOH. Negative logarithm base 10 concentration of OH minus ion E is called as pOH solution or pH pOH scale very important in unit of pH and pOH scale in mole delta meter minus q okay all students are clear any queries are discussed with me okay thank you